What's up everyone, Ed Jeanette here, your favorite real estate agent here in Savannah, Georgia. And today we're going to talk about something that can be a little bit boring, but it's vital that you understand if you're thinking about buying or selling a house. And it's something I throw around a lot in that monthly market report that I do, which is the word median. And the, and the difference between median versus average. Okay, I'm going to make this quick. The, this slide that you're looking at is the raw data. The raw data is what you need to do, what you need in order to calculate either the average or the median. In this case, what I did is I randomly picked four days right around Thanksgiving where there were 27 homes sold, all right? Now, this is what you need to calculate the average. That one column there uh, is the sales price of all the homes that sold, and then the, the, other, the other red box is the number of homes that sold. And then all you do is add up that column of, of homes sold, the sales prices, which adds up to 11,388,198, divide it by 27, and you come up with an average of around $420,000, okay? Now the median is super easy to figure out. The median is just the middle. So you, you line all these up uh, um, in order, and then the, you find the one that's in the middle, okay? So it's, it's um, uh, 27 so the middle would be in this case would be four, 14 14 right yeah so in this case the median this represents where half of the market is and the other half of the market is so half of the home sold for less than three hundred and fifty thousand nine hundred and ninety dollars and the other half sold for more okay so this gives you good representation of what the what the entire market's doing all right now here's the problem with averages all right, if we change just one number, say that the one home that sold on the bottom there for $1.35 million, say that actually sold for $13,500,000, okay, just one home, it would, throw, it would throw the average off by more than double. So you see the average because the one home sold changes to $871,785, okay, just because of one home but that doesn't represent the entire market where the median really does. It shows you more of what's going on in the market because you've got half of the homes that have sold are less than 350 and half of them are above, but the average really throws the whole thing off. I hope this helped. Please uh, tune in and watch that uh, monthly market report because I think it's probably the most in-depth market report that you're gonna find anywhere. Uh, there's great statistics that they have uh, uh, on the MLS. But um, anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. And if you have any questions, please message me on any of the social media sites. Thanks again.